Hi, I thought I'd show you how I've been training muscles called traps. That's these muscles on the top here. Now, I've been particularly weak in those, and so I've had to do a lot of work to get them to change and to let them come up a little bit. I think there's nothing worse than having what I would call gutter shoulders. In other words, here it dips down to the shoulders here. So in other words, you look like you've got gutters. Um, it's really necessary to work these and normally what happens is when we're doing deltoid exercises like side raises, it actually does work them a little bit. But I'm going to show you specific exercises to actually work these traps. And one of them is ordinary shrugs. Now, I'm working very light just to show you the actual exercise that I've been doing. Okay, so you hold the dumbbells by your sides. Go quite heavy. You'll have to work out the weight for yourself. And it's just a straightforward up and down movement. So it's a shrug. And all you're doing is you're lifting the weight up and bringing it down. But concentrate on the trap muscle itself. Make sure that the trap actually lifts it. Don't use your arms to lift. Let your shrugs, let your traps do that. Up, down. Up, down. Now one of the things you to avoid, because you can cause a lot of shoulder damage, and I'll show you what a lot of people do is they actually rotate the shoulder. So in other words, they're doing this type of movement. Avoid doing that because I can tell you, you will cause shoulder damage and you'll actually damage the joints in your shoulders. And we have a great deal of movement in our shoulders more than any other joint in our body. And by rotating them too much with a lot of weight on, you can damage them. So just do the exercise straight up and down. Another one that I've used is upright rowing. And that is a particularly good one because you can actually concentrate on the muscle and actually contract the muscle when you've lifted the weight. So it's just a straightforward barbell with some reasonably heavyish weights. Don't get too heavy, but go what you can handle. Okay, and it's lifting it straight up and bringing it down. Now what's good about it is if you lift it up and you actually try and make the muscle stand out, okay? You can see I'm contracting the muscle and I'm pushing the traps out as far as I can. Up contract the muscle, push it out as far as you can. You can actually feel it really pull, push it out, okay. One of the things you can do is a little bit of a rowing motion, but don't do it too much because otherwise you have the same problem as rotating the shoulders, but lifting it up and just letting it come out a little bit so that you put a little bit more pressure on them. Up and out slightly, okay. And contract them, push the muscle out. Try and make the muscle as big as you can. You'll find then that your traps will develop nicely and you'll end up not having what I call gutter shoulders. So I hope that helps you. If you go very heavy, you might find when you finish training, you could end up with a slight headache because it's quite a bit of pulling on the neck. So don't be too alarmed, but go within reason, use common sense. That's all bodybuilding and weightlifting is, common sense. I hope this helps you to get some really good results.